Okay, what's up everyone? Welcome back to uh what Silverfall. And uh yeah, I went ahead and you know I saved back there wherever the hell we were. And uh when I started it back up, um I'm not quite sure where we are. Um Oh, we're back in the camp deal. I, I saw these guys walking around, I was like, wait a minute, they put me in a different camp, man. But uh Alright, um, Morka the Good. I think that's a lady troll, huh? Let's see. How horrible. All these monsters. And yet... Oh, no, 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 no. How horrible. All these monsters. And he was there with them. I'm sure. It's all my fault. They came looking for me and they killed all these innocent people. And I, who should have died, have survived. Let's see. What do you mean? Who was with the monsters? Why should you have died? Ha! If you go on like that, it seems to me that you won't survive very long. If that makes you feel any better, look around you. All those sick, injured people who have lost everything. If they keep hearing you say that everything is your fault, they're gonna start to believe you. I'm gonna... Uh, I wanna... I wanna investigate. The Prince. The Prince of Monsters. No, he was nice, just a child. Ah, I don't know anymore, who are you? Are you here for revenge? All right, let's see, it seems that the attack was has seriously shaken you up. I am Fatisha of Silverfall, and the only thing that matters to me right now is to get us out of here alive and find my master. Revenge can wait. Or what mumbo jumbo? You have a serious blow to the head. Sorry, but I have better things to do than talk to a madman. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's see this. I think I should help you. Maybe he will forgive me. But I, I don't even know who I am. Ah, uh, what horrible monsters. Uh, hmm, I think I'll leave you now. <laughs> say I may be able to help you I'm gonna look for her yeah sure all right and uh, update you Morka all right also kind of change the uh, my control scheme here refugee and uh, who that what's up chow nuck hello some disarray, eh? Hey. Here we are, sloshing about in the mud. Mm -hmm. Those crazy Mother Nature lovers must be happy. <laughs> so, what can I do for you? A new sword, maybe? Would you be willing to do me a little favor? Hmm. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, I say I'm not against a bit of activity, so how can I be of help? Yeah. Well, as you know, I'm a fan of progress. Okay. All those old wives' tales won't take us very far. Salma is nice, but if we really want to advance, it's not exactly with herbal tea that we can do it. <laughs> this marsh abounds with very interesting gases. Gases? <laughs> gases? <laughs> what do you want to do with them, man? An incredible energy source. With it, we won't be cold, nor end up in the dark. Okay. I've seen the Necro Raiders use them, and believe me, there's no one better than them when it comes to science, even if they are a bit rough around the edges. All right. If you say so, but I still don't see how I can be of any use to you. To be able to use the gas constantly, we must find at least three sources, install a pump, and since these little beauties are fragile, creatures must not come to ruin the mechanics. All right, so let's see. So if I understood correctly, I must find three large gas sources, install a pump, and kill the creatures surrounding them. Yeah. Exactly. Okay, um... Well, I don't really care if it harms the marsh. It's all zombies anyways, man. Uh, cool. I'm gonna go do it. Uh, what is with this, uh, blacksmith's assistant? He has no voice. Alright, um, are you an adventurer by any chance? It's so rare to meet anyone who's been here further than the neighboring mangrove. 
All right. Um, I guess you could say that I'm an adventurer. Why? You see, I work with the village blacksmith and I supply his materials. He is a talented man and always looking for new ideas. And I heard about things that I'm sure would help him whip up some masterpieces. All right, um, what kind of material? I've been told of bones of ancient animals that can only be found in the east. Where the earth is red, the bones are buried, of course, which means they can't, they are not easy to gather. But if you find a way to get some, a dozen or so, for example, um, yeah, what well, would I get in exchange there, buddy? The first product you find, of course. Well, that... That doesn't sound very beneficial to me. As if I find it, I find it, you know? And I'm giving you a dozen? Come on, man. Let's see, uh... Alright, if I find some bones buried in the cloud works desert, I will bring them to you. Uh, yeah, I think you're gonna have to promise me a bit more. I'm not going to comb through the desert just for a weapon made of bone. Well, I'm not sure I can promise you anything more. A, a bit of gold, maybe? All right, if I find some bones buried in the desert, I, I'll bring them back to you. All right, so he's gonna give me some gold. Uh, let's see, uh, uh, this guy is just mid-step. Who's that? Oh, this is that dude. Hey, 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 hey. All right, um. Oh, we're at it's the same thing. Um, yeah, what is it? Uh, Alright. Should you give me something more? Yeah, I'll take care of it. Yeah. Rock potion. Okay. Oi. Who's green? Is that one that I haven't... Hey, Heron. You look exhausted. Hey. You managed to protect us against future attacks. I heard you were able to destroy a number of these creatures. Oh, let's see. I encountered a large number of them, and I think I cleared the area, so we're okay for a while. I want to return there tomorrow at daybreak. Um. Yeah. I've thought about it, and I don't think that's the way we'll get out of this. I have another idea, but here, take a few coins I scraped together. All right. Maybe you can buy some useful things from the surviving merchants. Come and see me again when you're ready and rested. Cool. All right. Uh, let's see. Mm, I don't see any arrows pointing me anywhere, but uh, there were some more foos down here I wanted to kill, right? They just straight up respawn. No, no, run back, baby. Alright, there we go. Take that. Take some arrows to the face. Whoa, that's a crossbow, man. Give me the crossbow. Shoot him. I gained another uh, thing. Alright. Uh, I just I want to clear everything out. Why is this all oh, sparkly? Alright. Whoa, 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 Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Level three zombie. All right, and that is a, uh, an earring. All right. Some more over here, huh? A champion zombie. Shoot him, shoot him. 
Another champion zombie. This looks bad for me. Get him! Get him! Man! Level 6 ultimate! Apprentice is like crossbow. Alright, well, uh, yeah, she's gonna have to uh, relax her a little bit there. And let's see, I got uh, level 5 ordinary. Level 3 good quality, attack speed quite slow. Plus 1% weapon speed. Uh, damage 10 to 32. Uh, 12 to 37. Well, this one seems quite a bit better than this one. Uh, and let's see. Uh, um, peasant's tunic. Man, I thought that uh, you got something good there. Doesn't seem like the earring didn't even do anything for her. Oh, this is what I got. Plus 8 power, plus 5%. Um, fire resistance, 3 armor, 1 intelligence. Well, hell yeah, I'm gonna put that on. Alright, so... Uh, man, her fucking health fucking regen slow, huh? What's this? Oh, it's like a... I thought it was a thumb or something. All right. Uh, well, hell, man, that was uh, that was a little rough. I gotta tell you. So, uh, well, let me see. I, I map some buttons here. So now, I, I mean, I could put you know eight attribute points down on stuff. I'm still trying to make up my mind if I want to go you know melee or if I want to go ranged. Or what? I think I'm kind of leaning towards ranged. Uh, right now, I'm leaning towards more constitution, though, because man, it regens slow, and this should make it um, regen faster. So, uh, yeah, but. Uh, Long range weapons, chances of hitting, and decisive blows. I guess that's like a crit, right? It also increases the chance of dodging. Um, that sounds that sounds like reasonable, right? Let's see, and this has a attack range of 10 and 10. Alright. Um, huh. Yeah, you know, I'll go two like that, and, uh... Man, I, something's almost telling me it's probably better to do strength. Or intelligence, because that's what it was trying to show off in the beginning, right? But, uh... Yeah, I might, I might, I might do a ranger. Let's go ahead and go. I, I don't, I don't really care at this point. And then let's, uh... Go to shoot, and, uh... Eat skill points, um, damage multiplier is uh, 5%, so raise it up and we get another 5%, and it keeps going up by 5%, and increases the chance of hitting. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. And uh, what's this? Destabilizing Quarrel. Uh, I think I want to go with guns, man. So, you know what? Maybe I'll just hold off on that. Um, disabling arrows, nah. I'll just stick with the basics at this point, and, uh... Whoa! Alright, what the hell's that? Apprentice Supervisor's Scepter. Alright, and, uh, what's that? Gloves and that crap. Let's see, but then there's uh, there's a couple more people back here somewhere. Whoa, whoa. Oh, they're like over here somewhere. Okay, go back. Take that zombie. All right. Let's see. Uh, life potion and. 
guild shield level four ordinary, but I do want that. So uh, let's see. Uh, same thing I have. Oh, this is the new one. I need to go technology. So how do I how do I advance in the technology tree? Let's see. Somewhere in this marsh here. Right. Well, level five zombie. Whoa, I run up so close. What's wrong with you? What? <laughs> damage to me man <clears throat> all right let's see uh... seems like she's like a way worse shot now oh he dropped all kind of stuff let's see Oh, air robes, huh? Gloves, excellent quality. Um, giant sword. Yeah, sure, give me all that stuff. And, uh... Well, plus 10 power, plus 5 uh, fire resistance, but, uh... Oh, the uh, gold ones are, are ultimate. Alright, and, uh... Necklace. Doesn't do anything, but, uh... Giant sword. Uh, yeah, uh, that'll do better than the other one. What kind of? Oh, it's a it's a two-handed, huh? Hmm. I don't know. I don't really care for the two-handed weapons. Wait. Wow, they just keep on popping up, huh? Whoa, 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 shit. Man. Take that, ghoul. Hey. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you ain't getting away from me, man. Oh, 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 oh. Bam. She gotta go so close, man. Why is this guy shooting me? What's his problem? I've done nothing to you. Holy crap, look at that. I have to use a potion or something. I'm going in the camp. This control scheme's a little funny. Oh, oi! I had to use a potion. I had to. Help me, somebody. Dude, don't you see him right there? Do something. What the hell, he's just going about his business. No, you ain't gonna last long. You don't even know who this guy is. He's a guard and stuff. He didn't even care, dude. Oh, dude, and I'm supposed to be helping these people out? Oh, man. I don't know. Ingrates. Ingrates, I tell you. Whoa, they were supposed to pop out of the ground, but they were just waiting there for me. They are waiting in ambush. Get them. Get them, baby. Man, what's that? Wait a minute. Whoa, she's bleeding. <laughs> All right, well, uh... And that was a little bit. Whoa, look at all those guys in there. I didn't know you can look around like that. All right, well, uh, you know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and pause it because I'm gonna have to sit and wait um, for, my <laughs> for my health to regen. Anyways, 
So, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll pick it up next time right here. And we'll take on the rest of these groovy ghoulies in there. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, hope you guys are enjoying it. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. All right.